What is up guys, my name is Superman and welcome to episode number 36 of my Hamburg career mode in FIFA 17. Now, we are going into big games. We are going into the Champions League with our beloved Hamburg. And this is our first game, I believe. Why are there top scores? Oh, of course, because we had to go through the um, three stages. I'm not sure how to say that. Qualification stages? I think like that. Anyways, we have... Atletico de Madrid, Sakhtar Donetsk and Celtic in our group. Um, Atletico are probably the favorites, but we might fight for that second place, so let's hope to get to off to, to a good start against Celtic. Let's go. Okay, yeah, this is my squad. We have Simeon up top, Haas in the number 10, Bajoken and Kostic on the wings, Keita and Holbe at my defensive midfield. We have Santos, Lengle, Lemos, Bizek at the back with Sapon Arengo on the bench, are clever Sakai, Vanake and Mascarel. Bahui, Gregoric and Muto. Let's go. Santos, Douglas. Oh my god. What a goal. What a goal. 1 0, guys. I was just left speechless at that goal. Amazing shot, and we're 1 0 up at half time. Hopefully, we get a win. Here we go, guys. 1 0 at the end. Pretty good result, and we get our first three points in the Champions League. Okay, guys, we have the next game. It's a pretty big one against Bayer Leverkusen. Okay guys, this is my squad to face Bayer. Uh, Simeone starts up top, has in the number 10, Bajoken and Kostic on the wings. I have Keita and Holby as my defense midfielders. Biziak this time on the left side. Lengle, Lemos and Sakai at the back with Sapon Arengo. On the bench we have Kleber, Santos, Vanake and Mascarel, Bajoi, Gregoric and Muto. Let's go. Come on. Gio Simeone! What a cross from Matthias Haze and a very very good header from Giovanni Simeone. It was just nice, really nicely played, 1-0. Here we go guys, we're leading 1-0 again at halftime, so hope we can also get a win just in the last game. Here we go guys, another 1-0 win, good job. Okay, we have Bremen at home, I do believe I can simulate this game without too much trouble. Let's see what we get, a 4-1 win. Great news, Alias Zagar is coming to our first team, a young Slovenian left midfielder, I believe. Let's see, let's see his stats. He's a left mid slash cam, left footed, 5 foot 10, not too fast, so maybe he could be better as a cam, although he hasn't got good strength either, nor stamina. He has good ball control, good curve, good dribbling, let's see, well, He's decent. Uh, we'll probably be using him sometimes, not all the time. I mean, in just a few games, but I think he's going to be a good addition. We have Ingolstadt. Shouldn't have too much problem against them. Hopefully. Hope I'm not mistaken. If I am, that would be pretty bad. But I'm not. 3 1, although Kostic is injured. We have Shakhtar. I think at home we should be able to beat both Shakhtar and Celtic with simulations. So let's see if that stands. For now, yes, we get a 2-0 win. Okay, another winnable game. We have a lot of winnable games right now. It's Stuttgart in the Bundesliga. Should get a win. 3-0. Okay, we have qualifiers for the World Cup, I think. Or is the European Cup? We'll see here. For the World Cup. So, hopefully we can get a decent result against Hungary. We get a 1-0 win. And the second one is against Turkey. Another very winnable game, I believe. 2-1. Okay guys, we have a big game, it's against Schalke. Okay guys, this is my squad, we have Simeon up top, Haas in number 10, Bajo getting Kostic on the wings, Keita and Holby as my defense midfielder, then we have Santos, Lengle, Lemos, Biziek at the back with Sapanar on goal. On the bench we have Hribar, Sakai, Vanake and Mascarel, Bahui, Gregoric and Konate. Let's go. 0-0 zero, zero at half time, nothing special was going on, but hopefully in the second half we can score a goal. Oh, I can see the run. Kostic, Kostic. Oh my god. The winner in the last seconds of the game. Filip Kostic. Oh, that's just amazing. Here we go, guys. Another 1 0 win. It's a bit odd, but we get it, so good job. It's time for a quick squad training. And we have Saponaro, now 85 rated. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode right over here before the Atletico Madrid game in the Champions League. We're currently actually first in the table because Atletico de Madrid drew against Celtic and that means we are currently in the best position but of course if Atletico beat us 
it's going to be still very frustrating. But if we beat Atletico, the Madrid will be pretty much qualified for the next round, except if something weird and exceptional happens and we'll lose all three games, which hopefully won't happen. Anyways, uh, this has been the first episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to do all the good stuff. Until next time, peace.